Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Lynn's Homestead. We're here to revisit this heater has been underneath this tractor a while. It's been uh, pretty cold out. Uh, it's actually, funny as may seem, it feels warmer in here where this heater's been underneath this tractor. So let me uh, do one little test. I got my little infrared uh, thermometer here. So let's see. Let's pick a spot. How about up in the corner? Up there. It's 53 degrees up there. This wall over here, 51. In the other room, it's 50. It's hard. 60. I'm just going to point this thing underneath. Because we're going to see how warm is the engine and how warm is the battery. So we're just going to raise the tarp up. Okay, it's 57 underneath there. So let's uncover the tractor. Get to the engine department. Oh yeah, I feel the heat coming off this. The engine is 72 degrees. The battery is 77. This little heater is making a difference. So let's uh, see how hard is it now to start this tractor. Now it's been getting warmer out, but it's supposed to get in the 30s this week. So we'll turn the, uh, see how hard it is to start this thing. So we'll turn the key on for a few seconds, let the pump do its thing. Then we'll go to the glow plugs. When it's normally this cold, it takes a long time for this thing to start. Hot dog, it actually started up faster than it ever had. There's the difference. I know it seems kind of strange. Why are you putting this little personal heater underneath a tarped track? There's the reason why. Because if I don't, it barely wants to crash over. That's right. I proved the point that a personal heat, it's only 400 watts, tarp down to the floor. And it started right up faster than it's ever done when it's cold. The battery, 77 degrees. And it's so cold in here. I go in the other part of the barn when I came in, it's 41 degrees. It's 50 degrees here. It's in the 70s, the engine. The battery is almost 78 degrees. A little heater might seem kind of stupid, but it works. Last year, I do believe, actually the year before, I set a heating pad across top of it and then did the squat. I'm trying to save from spending $300 for a battery for this thing. Do not let your batteries get cold. Now, this is only December. This is December 3rd. Cold water, extreme cold for this area is coming. Be prepared. Go to Walmart. Pay $10 for that little heater. Stretch a tarp. I got it sealed all the way around the thing. Just set it underneath. Plug it in. Now, you're probably wondering, oh, gee, well, my electric bill is going to be high. 
I just got my electric bill. And due to some other tools that I got, $60. Protect your tractor. If your tractor is sitting outside, tarp it, protect it. Put a little heater underneath. Tractor will thank you.